All right, folks, we have here, this is called the Will Power Chair. This is the CI2 Will Power Chair. This is a, a new power chair on the market. It's only been out for a while, this model here. Uh, this power chair here has all kinds of features on it that you're probably gonna like. You can actually, if you have a loved one and you need to drive the chair for them, you can walk with your phone next to the chair and drive the chair from your phone. So we'll show you that in a few minutes. Let's go over the power chair for a minute. So this is the wheel power chair. Uh, the heaviest piece on this power chair is 42 pounds. 42 pounds, it comes apart in three pieces, which we'll show you that in a minute here. But let's look at the power chair. This power chair turns in a circle, but if you look at the front wheels there, if I turn, you see how the front wheel turns, but they don't move? Because these are rollers. See this rolling? All these are rollers right here. So when you turn a circle, it looks like the front wheel is dragging, but it's not. It's rolling on those rollers. So this is what makes this chair really nice. You can see, again, you'll see the roller. It rolls on the rollers on the front. And you can't tell when you drive the chair, there's no bumps, nothing. So these, these are solid tires. They're 10 inch in the front, 10 inch in the back, 10 inch in the front tires. This power chair, total weight of the power chair is about 120 pounds. It has a maximum weight of 300 pounds is the maximum weight. This chair right here has the 20 inch seat, but it comes in three size, 16, 18, and 20. 16, 18, and 20 inches. And it also comes in a 16 or 18 deep. So you have two choice of depth, 16 or 18 deep, but the width, you can go uh, 16, 18, or 20 wide, okay? The foot plate does flip up, okay? And you do have lights on the elbows here. You can see the, you can see if I turn the power off, you'll see the lights go off. If I turn the power on, you'll see the lights go on. The arms do flip up, so if you pull this lever, you can pull, you can slide in and out from this way. The joystick is on the right side, but if you need it on the left side, it can be switched to the left side if you're left-handed, okay? This chair has independent suspension, so all four wheels have its own suspension. So it's got all four wheel or independent suspension. This also has electromagnetic brakes, so when you let go of the joystick like this, the chair brakes automatically. It's got electromagnetic brakes in the motors, okay? So let's turn the chair around one more time. You can see also there's a nice big basket under here. Now the width of this chair, let's look at the back, from here to here is 21.8. So let's, let's just go with 22 inches. Remember, this is a 20 inch seat. So if I go from outside of arm to outside of arm, now I've got 25 and a half inches. So remember that with a 20 inch seat, you're gonna be a 25 and a half inches wide. And the base, of course, is gonna be a 22 inches. So the bigger the seat, it makes the base larger. You still got to go through a door with these arms, okay? So I'm assuming with the smaller seats, the arms are going to be closer and closer and closer, okay? So you can see the suspension in the back right here for each wheel. You can see the anti-tip wheels right here, which is nice. You can also see, if I turn the chair around, you might be able to see it in that angle right there. This is how you put your chair in free wheel, so you would turn the power off. You see the, the little red lever here, and if you push it down on both motors, down, you can see how easy, whoa, you can see how easy it rolls, okay? So your lever's right here, but don't forget, when you're done, put your chair back in gear. Also, if you ever take this chair apart and you put it back in the car and it's not running, make sure you check your handles. Maybe you push one of those handles down in one wheel and it'll blink on your joystick, okay? So make sure the wheels are always locked when you put it back together, and uh, then you should have a neat problem. Again, if you push this, pull this handle up, you can push this down. These arms are really, really solid. I'm pushing as hard as I can. So this is a very well-constructed power chair. I'm gonna turn the power back on. All right, so now, also this chair is about 39 inches long. The top speed of this power chair is five miles an hour. You got four speed in this chair. Top speed is five miles an hour, okay? So now we're gonna look about how to take this chair apart for transportation, okay? So the first thing you would do if you're gonna take it apart for transportation, you would make sure the power is off, fold the seat down, and they say in the manual, just grab the arms 
and pull straight up. As you can see, I grab the arms and I pull straight up. Makes it very easy to pull the seat off, okay? Now the basket, as if you watch my unboxing demonstration, it just clamps onto the frame. So if I pull it out, you can see the frame is round and it clamps right on these right here, you'll see it. So when you put the basket on, you just clamp it to the frame. Look at the size of this basket. You can put two gallons of milk in here. I don't know if you want to carry two gallons of milk with you, but that's how big it is. All right, now if you're going to take the, the base apart from the front, first thing you do is pull the battery pack out. There's a little button right here, so if you push that button, you can see the battery pack comes right off, okay? When the battery pack is off, now you can see in the front right here, there's a little lever right here, okay? So I'm going to get on my knees here. I'm going to pull that lever up, and I'm just going to pull this out from here. Okay, so now you've got, probably this is your base. Probably the, the heaviest piece right here is your base, okay? And then you've got your front end right here. And you have your seat right here. You have your battery pack. This battery pack, you can take it in the house and you can charge it right here into your house, right there. This is a lithium ion battery pack. It weighs six pounds. This is six pounds total. You have your basket and you have your seat. So now what we're gonna do, we're gonna put it back together. When you put it back together, again, you will raise this up like this so it's sitting on its tip wheels. You'll hold it right here. You're going to bring this bar right here, right under here, where my two fingers are at. It's going to lean in those slots. So I'm going to bring that bar into that slot. And then, folks, this is very well constructed. Very, very well constructed. One more thing. When you get your, when you get your power chair, your wheel power chair, you'll get your owner's manual everything you need but you also have an allen wrench in here a big allen wrench in this plastic bag okay if you want to adjust the height of the seat post if you look over here i'm in the third hole i think there's two holes available and i'm in the third hole. i could go up one more hole so if you want to adjust the height you have to go here and loosen it up right under here pull the pin out and then go whatever height you want now, let me just say something. When I loosened it up earlier, they had the bolts really, really tight. So it might take a little bit of strength originally to unloosen it. But I have it in the third hole. That's how you adjust the height of the seat. But that comes in your ma in, in inside your owner's manual and your packet. You'll have this too. So you never put the battery pack in until the base is put together. When the base is put together, then you slide your battery pack in and it snaps right in. Basket goes on first. You can put the basket on afterward, but it's going to be a lot harder. So put your basket on, snap it on there, and then grab your seat. Pull your seat back. Turn your power back on. If everything comes on, if, if you've done everything properly, the chair should move forward and it should move reverse. A couple more things about this power chair. The ground clearance on this power chair is 2.2 inches. 2.2 inches ground clearance. Also, this power chair here comes in six colors. As you can see, we have the white color here. It comes in white, blue, red, pink, black. Uh, so it comes in six colors. It's in your manual. Colors are coming in. So when you order the chair, let us know what color. The power, this power chair has a distance of 11, up to 11 miles. So some of you are going to get 11 miles. Some are going to get more. Some of you are going to get less. It depends how you drive the chair, the weight of the user, if you're going uphill. So that 11 miles is just a good uh, indication. So the top distance you're going to get with this power chair is up to 11 miles on one battery charge. This battery is a lithium ion battery. It only takes about five hours to charge because it's lithium. So it charges a lot quicker than most batteries out there. This power chair is also approved for airline transportation. So if you're gonna take this chair onto an airline, you can tell them what it is. 
Uh, it's a wheel power chair. They'll, they'll be familiar with it at the airline, and it's approved for airline transportation. Another thing about this chair, when you look at your joystick right here, it says 23 on my joystick. That's how much power I have left, 23. It goes from 99 to zero. So I'm about three quarters empty right now. So if you look at your manual, it tells you 99% is full. 23 would be about one fourth left of the, of the distance in the power chair. So this is a new power chair. I have not charged it yet. So when you charge this power chair, you will take your charger right here, okay? And you'll plug it right behind. You'll take your charger port right here and you can plug it right into the chair right here. There's the entrance for it right there. Or you can take the battery pack out if you want to. If you take the battery pack out, it's real simple. Push the button, take the battery pack out. There's your charging port. There's your release to release the battery pack. As I said earlier, this is six pounds. Put the battery pack back in. So you can charge it in the chair or you can take the battery pack in the house. This is the, if you wanna drive this chair with your cell phone, you're gonna have an app the to download to your cell phone, what you do, there's a code number. If you go under the seat right here, when you take, get your chair, you see this little sticker? There's your code number right there. It's sitting in that square under the cushion, okay? So you have to have that code number there. You put it in your phone, and you can see right now, it's ready to go. So if you're using your app and the button's not working on the top, it'll say reconnects. If you lose your connection, just hit reconnect and we're back to it. So now here's your, here's your joystick. So if I just move this forward, you can see I can drive the chair. I can reverse it. So if you're walking with someone, you could, you could, you could just go like this. Look how easy that is. That is just fantastic. Look at that. So it actually, this is the easiest one I've ever done before. This is so easy. It, it responds exactly. So if you're with a loved one, you pretty much, you can do whatever you want with this. And this is the first time that I've done this. Now, what I've done here, I've not practiced before. So I'm telling you, that's, it was very easy, very easy. There's also programming uh, on here. You can soften the speed. You can tone down the response all on your app, okay? So I'm not gonna go through all that. Read your manual. But I'm telling you, this chair here also has the app. So I'm gonna, uh, I'm gonna turn this off and Go back to the chair. Even your app tells you what your, how much battery you have left. It says 23 on here, and you can see it says 23 on the joystick. So your, your phone tells you everything. Also, you can lock this chair. It says lock and unlock. So you can leave this chair and lock it just by hitting the lock button. So if you don't want someone to mess with your chair, if you have the app on your phone, you can lock it. The wheel power chair, the CI2 model, four wheel power chairs, Tires are 10 inches all the way around. It turns on its front end because the wheels right here are spinning. So it's, it's just a phenomenal job the way they've engineered this chair. You've got three seat size. You've got, you have 20, 18, and 16. That's the width. You can also go 18 and 16 in depth, okay? Um, the chair itself, the power chair itself is a little less than 22 inches. But remember, if you get the 20 inch seat, your frame is larger. So your arms are gonna be at 25 and a half inches. From here to here is gonna be 25 and a half inches. So that's the number you need to remember. On the 20 inch seat, you're gonna be wider. I'm sure on an 18 inch seat, they're gonna be at 23 inches. And at 16, they're probably gonna be within the wheels, okay? This chair has a top speed of five miles an hour. It has independent suspension on all four wheels solid tires all the way around, maximum speed of five miles an hour. It has a climbing ability of up 10%, which is very, very good. It also has the app where you can drive the chair with the person in it. It comes apart in three pieces. The heaviest piece is 42 pounds. That was the rear end. 42 pounds is the heaviest piece, okay? The joystick is on the right. It can go to the left, okay? The total length of the power chair is about 39 inches. The total weight of the chair without taking it apart is about 120, 120 pounds, okay? It comes in six colors, red, white, blue, black, pink. And I know there's one more color, it'll be in the manual, but there's six colors they say in the manual you can get with the chair. As I said, the joystick can go on the left side. Uh, you can, with the app, you can do all kinds of stuff with this power chair. The foot plate does flip up. 
okay? Also the basket, you got a large basket back here. So if you need to transport some stuff, you got plenty of room for a large, large purse. Your manual levers are here. There's two, one for each wheel and all that kind of good stuff. Your battery pack, when you charge it, is in the back. So you can take the battery pack out and you can charge it right here. Or you can leave the battery pack in the chair and charge it to the port right here and put this back on when you're done in case it rains. Okay, you have anti-tip wheels over here. You have a maximum weight capability on this chair and you also have lights back here on the, on the, on the back end. The weight capability of this chair is 300 pounds. And the last thing folks, your total distance is up to 11 miles. And this chair is airline approved. So you, don't have, you, don't, you can call your airline, tell them what kind of chair you have. It's airline approved, ready to go. So if you're looking for the next futuristic technology, advanced technology, and you want to be one of the only ones that have a, something of a chair like this with the latest in technology, and all of you are good with your phone, better than me probably. Uh, and if you have a loved one you need to be transporting and you need to do it with your phone, this is, would be a great, great way of doing it. So this is the wheel power chair. This is the wheel power chair in the, uh, model number CI2. Top speed of this power chair is five miles an hour. And as I mentioned inside earlier, the wheels, these spin. All these spin right here. So when you turn a circle, it's weird. It looks like the wheel's dragging, but it's not dragging, it's really turning. So it's really, really ingenious the way they have this set up. And this chair is very well constructed. It was, you can tell, also it was very, very well packed in the box. When we unloaded the box, it was packed, super well packed. That tells you how they take care and they, they really care about their product. But it's really, it's really a solid power chair. The seat is super comfortable. It is a low back. You're not gonna get any higher than this, but it, it, is, it is super comfortable for my back and everything. All right, so with your app here on your phone, you can drive this chair from the side. So I'm gonna drive it right now. You can see me going straight with it. Then I'm gonna turn around. So if you have a loved one and you wanna drive them in this chair like this, you can walk right next to them and talk to them as the chair is being driven. And you have your joystick right on your cell phone right here. So it's definitely gonna be at a reduced speed when you're driving the chair with the cell phone, okay? So again, this is the wheel power chair. This power chair, as I said earlier, is from outside of arm, outside of arm because of the 20 inch seat is 25 and a half inches. The chair is about 22 inches wide suspension on all four wheels you have two motors it does have up to 11 miles on a battery charge it has a lithium battery pack that's approved for the airline you have three seat size you can have you can have the 20 18 or 16 inch seat on this chair solid tires all the way around you have your charger you charge it right here from the back it comes apart in three pieces the heaviest piece is going to be your rear end which is going to be 42 pounds so uh, just a nice, nice power chair and it comes in six different colors. Hi, I'm Mark. And my name is Alex. We're co-owners of Mark's Mobility. I started this company in 1995. We sell many products, not just what you see in this video. If you have any questions or concerns, please call us at the number below at 800-677-6293. Thank you and have a wonderful day.